Princess of Guardian of Rights. Uh, she's basically been held up the north. Uh, she's one of the members of she's one of the members of um, the Thirty Two County Sovereignty Movement. And uh, one of them is she's been held uh, kind of without charges up in a prison up the north. And uh, what that means is like uh, she's she's basically been held, I think, under solitary confinement, all this kind of thing. And people are just really unhappy about it. It's been going on since I think May last year. Solitary confinement, uh, 21, 21 hour lockdown or something like that. And uh, she's like apparently really sick and all this sort of stuff. So they're trying to get some support and some some kind of. Um, pressure to get released, that kind of thing. Marion Price at Edna. We're here today to demand the release of a very ill woman, a very principled woman. Marion Price is lying in a hospital in Belfast in very severe medical conditions. But not only is she ill, she's interned at a time when people believe that internment is over. Internment is not over in the six counties. Marion Price and Martin Harry are both being interned up to now by Owen Patterson, the Secretary of State, and now by the person who continues in his job. So Marion Price has spent 18 months in solitary confinement for doing nothing. Marion Price has not been found guilty of any offence. Marion Price was pardoned in 1980 because she was at that stage quite ill, having been brought back from an English prison, having spent 200 days being force-fed one of the most evil um, facets of imprisonment. She was brought back to the six counties and in 1980 she was given a part and into what is absolutely unbelievable Owen Patterson claimed that pardon had been lost he had her re-arrested and she is now being held as an internee first of all in McGabbery prison later on because she was ill she was transferred to Hyde Bank, which is a so-called medical facility, and now because her condition is worsening, she's been brought to the city hospital in Belfast. But one of the messages that needs to go out from this meeting, and I'm not speaking, um, we will have four very eminent speakers following me here. One of the very strong messages that needs to go out from this meeting is that Marion Price, her condition is deteriorating by the day. Her Marion Price, a gull in Olcus in Eigen Lay, the physicule, I guess, in a hinton. Toshi Antin, I guess, Toshi a bra, Erguini Kusselinga, he is going say. It's up to people like us and other people who have marched in Belfast, in Derry, in Coal Island, and who have attended meetings throughout the country 
to bring the message of the illness and the injustice of this to the politicians, to the media and to the people in general and ensure that Marion isn't left in anywhere else except in the care of her own family where she should be. Okay, the first, the first speaker we have today.